Hey yo, what is up? My name is RJ and welcome to my weekly vlog. Hey guys, I know you just saw me on the couch doing the intro and I'm suddenly in PJs looking disheveled in my bathroom with horrible lighting, but um, I thought I'd do a little get unready with me while I just chat because I didn't film anything today. And it's actually 2 a.m. on Tuesday, but we're gonna pretend this is the Monday clip, okay? This is the Monday clip. But um, I've been wanting for three, four days to go to this cute little cafe that my mom brought me to. They have crepes and they're awesome. And I've been craving a crepe from there since I went there with my mom last week. And so I've been trying to get myself out of bed because they close at 3 p.m. And I've been trying to get myself out of bed to get up in time to like go to the cafe before it closes. Um, but I keep waking up at 1, 2 p.m. and it's just like not enough time for me to go there. I don't want to go right before closing, you know, like that's embarrassing. Um, no one wants to be that guy, so. And then, um, what else? I've been feeling this weird, like, okay, also I know it's been a minute since I've done just like a classic weekly vlog. Um, it's because I kind of fell off of them and also my phone keeps telling me it's out of storage, it's out of storage when I do weekly vlogs because I film too much, I guess. And it just started getting on my nerves. So I was like, okay, I'm just gonna not do that for a minute and I'm gonna do stuff that takes less storage. <laughs> so I've been feeling really like weirdly anxious just about life in general. Cause I feel like my life has been too quiet recently. It's been too like chill. And anyone else who, <sighs> anyone else who normally has something constantly going on in their life will understand this. But when you don't have some sort of like thing to focus on, like crisis or whatever, like it's weird. Like I don't have anything to focus on right now. Everything's just kind of meh. And I've talked about this before, but <sighs> sorry, I didn't take my propranolol today. So I'm going to be out of breath the whole time. But um, so I, I am bipolar too. And so before I was medicated last year, um, I didn't know what like normal, like mundane life was because like I was either down or up, you know, cause bipolar is like this normal life is like this, <laughs> you know? And, um, I, so basically this is the first time since I've been medicated that I haven't had something going on with my health this way or that way. And it's making me paranoid <laughs> because I am not used to this. I'm not used to having nothing going on, nothing to be like, oh my God, guys, this happened. And I think that's a good thing, but it's also, like I said, it's making me feel unsettled. And I also feel like I'm preparing, like I'm pre-charging for something big that's gonna happen. Like, I don't know if that's just my paranoia, but I can't tell if it's intuition or paranoia that's telling me this, but I feel like something is gonna happen. And I'm scared because I can't tell if it's a good or bad thing that's gonna happen. It kind of feels like a bad thing and it feels health related, but I don't know. I don't know, maybe I'm just being paranoid. Like maybe I'm just not used to, like in the past two, three years, I'm not used to feeling meh for this long and not having like a dip in health where like something random happens and I'm like freaking out so I'm just like paranoid and I'm like scared <laughs> so like is that like normal like does that make sense but anyways hopefully I can get up and go to this cafe tomorrow in the morning um morning is a strong word maybe um maybe I'll get up at like 11 and get there by noon who knows, but um, I also really desperately need to get groceries. So I may have to push the cafe to Wednesday and do groceries tomorrow if I get up. Cause I don't know if I'll get up with time to do both. Cause you know me, I'd be waking up late 
because I have late classes, so I have no reason to get up. Even my dog sleeps in. She does not wake me up. You'd think Luna would wake me up. If she really needs to go out, she does wake me up. Like, she's waking me up before when she was sick and, like, really had to take a shit. But, like, she sleeps in. So she is not a reliable alarm clock for me. It's so funny because my parents literally got me a dog so that I would wake up. So the dog would wake me up and I would be motivated to get up and get ready so I could walk the dog. <laughs> but she sleeps in more than me sometimes. So I just think that's funny. But anyway, that's kind of all I have to talk about right now that I can think of. Um, and I'm pretty much unready, so... I'll see you guys tomorrow in the morning, maybe? Hey, it's Tuesday. It is 3.50 p.m. I just finished getting ready. No, I did not go to the cafe. <laughs> um, but look at my new, I thrifted this like a week ago with my mom and I love it. It's so cute. Um, it's making me feel pretty. So, um, and look at my little pill earring, but um, I have class at five and it's almost four, so I'm kind of in a rush. So. Hey guys, I literally have five minutes to get to class, so I can't talk to you for long, but I thought this was sad. I took a bite out of this Oreo and then immediately felt too sick to eat it. So now there's just this bitten Oreo, but I know that if I leave it in there, I won't eat the rest of it because I'm weird about stuff like that. So I have to throw it away. Bye bye Oreo that I took one bite out of. Anyway, I have to put Luna up and head to my class. So I'll catch y'all later. Hey guys, it's Wednesday and Day three of not going to the cafe when I keep saying I will. Oh. My goal is to go before I drive back home to Alabama next week. Shit, what did I get on my... I got something on my sweatshirt. But anyways, I'm making dip. It <laughs> That doesn't look very appetizing. It looks good. It's cute and pink when you mix it together. But um, I'm making that dip that I made in a vlog a couple vlogs ago. So go watch that if you want to see me make dip. But... Um, Basically, I've ordered groceries because I just cannot get myself to go get them. So I've ordered groceries to be delivered um, so that I won't die without food. And <laughs> I'm making dip so that I can have it and like eat through it, eat through it, eat it before, cause Okay, so next Saturday, I'm driving home to Alabama for a week for spring break because I have two doctor's appointments. And then I'm coming right back for classes. But, uh, because classes, we only get a week of spring break and that's it. Um, let me, why is it like shimmering right there? <laughs> like, what the hell? But, um, anyways. I'm letting the cream cheese soften a little bit before I mix it up. I don't really think I have much to say other than finals are coming up and I've got a lot of homework and yeah, I've got a lot of shit to do, but good check-in. Hey guys, it's Thursday, um, except it's kind of 1 a.m., 1.30 a.m. on Friday, but shh. Um, it, this is totally my Thursday check-in. I am about to do a tarot reading for someone that ordered one. And um, if you want one too, you can go to the link in the description and order a tarot reading. Okay, anyways. And class was good. I had class until 7.30. Um, it was kind of boring because I already finished my project and all we did during class was work on the project. So I just kind of sat there and did nothing. I did a couple things, but I really just sat there and did nothing most of the time. But anyways. That's besides the point. I'm chilling. I'm gonna try. I keep saying I'm gonna try to go to the cafe tomorrow, but we'll see if that actually happens. Hey guys, it's actually Saturday. I did not film on Friday, but um, I just ordered sushi. 
I, I actually ate most of it already, but um, I also got boba. It's strawberry lemonade. Not much to report. My phone keeps telling me it's out of storage, so I don't know how much of this I can record. Okay. Um, I have a ton of homework to do, too. So, yeah, this might be a short and boring vlog. Nah. I woke up at 4 p.m. today and yesterday. I need to fix my sleep schedule really badly. Catch you later. I, in fact, did not catch you later. It is 3.01 a.m. on Monday. I was supposed to post the vlog yesterday. And then I edited it just now at 3 a.m. and realized that I didn't fucking end it. <laughs> That's kind of representative of how my life is. I'm kind of spacey and just meh, just bleh, you know? But anyways, if this was relatable, you should subscribe. Make sure to like and subscribe. Um, much love. I appreciate you. And I'll catch you in the, the, the next one. I'll probably do like a normal vlog next week because I'll have my doctor's appointments. But love you guys. Bye.